Yonkers police officers take defensive positions, guns drawn behind a car before they move in. A few minutes later, several officers run back towards an ambulance. It appears they're carrying the female officer shot by a suspect. She's 26-year-old Kayla Mayer, two-year veteran of the force. Police Commissioner Charles Gardner. Hero. You know, he had an injured officer, pulled her from the scene in the middle of a gun battle. And, and we're very proud of him. In cell phone video, you can hear the officer shout and then a barrage of bullets. One behind the other one. Boom, 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 boom. Like six shots uh, at the same time. The altercation started with a female police officer and her partner responding to a call about a suspicious vehicle in Ramsey Road and Park Avenue. When they approached, gunfire ensued. I'd love to know what those two guys were up to and why they felt it was necessary to start shooting at the cops. Officer Mayor, a two-year veteran of the force, was hit in the jaw. In this radio transmission, you can hear her partner's desperate calls for help. We have an officer shot in the face. Can we please get some news here? Mayor was transported to Jacoby Hospital in serious but stable condition. She is gutsy. Uh, and you could see it. She um, was very lighthearted and actually told us a lot of jokes. One suspect was shot and transported to the hospital in critical condition. Both men are in police custody. Now, police have not yet released the identities of the two men that were in that car. They say they found a handgun in the vehicle as well. Investigators say that one of the men, the shooter, may have had prior warrants out for his arrest, and they're still working with the district attorney to determine the charges against them. They may likely be facing attempted murder charges. In Yonkers, Magdalena Doris, CBS 2 News.